What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Shout out to Miss J. Um, she asked a question a couple of days ago here in the comments, and I just thought it was was a powerful question, man. And I, I truly believe a lot of people um, are still are still beginner at whether they're whether they're at the beginner level or even advanced, man. I'm I'm still seeing a lot of people, you know, confused on on the right way to be building an affiliate marketing business, um, especially in 2020, especially from this point on. You, you can't just post a link somewhere and, and someone's going to buy your stuff. Like it's not going to happen that way. Like at all at all. Um, now I had a video that I did a couple, I think it was maybe a couple weeks ago. It was regarding affiliate marketing with Amazon and how, how top, top affiliate marketers crush it. Um, so you know what? I'll tie that video. I'll tie that video. I'll look for it. I'll tie it to the end. So just stay to the end of this one and you'll see it pop up at the end. But that is a, a video that I did regarding niching down, regarding Amazon associates and making money with Amazon. But the same strategy applies for everything, whether it's Amazon, whether it's ClickBank. Miss um, J here, she had a question regarding ClickBank, right? Whether it's ClickBank, whether it's Best Buy, whether it's walmart.com whether it's any website any 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 website no matter which website you're choosing it doesn't matter affiliate marketing this this the strategies still apply and i'm building an affiliate marketing business with kartra mainly 99 percent of my affiliate income comes from kartra because i i truly believe in the residual aspect of making an income you want to find something that's going to pay you passively you want to you want to find something that's going to pay you residually every single month for the effort you did once, right? I got someone I promoted Kartra for example once that person got on it once, and every single month there's a bill reoccurring. Every single month there's a commission being paid out. Those are the commissions that I like when it comes to affiliate marketing. All these other affiliate promos, all these other platforms, ClickBank. Amazon, whatever, majority of them, nine out of 10 of them are all one time products, whether they're a digital product or an actual physical product, nine out of 10 of them are, so are one time deals, right? So if you're promoting any, any product on ClickBank, you're most likely making a one time commission, right? So you want to keep, keep it going. You want to keep it going. And that's why, again, I've done videos on this. You cannot just become an affiliate of these platforms and post your link on social media it's not going to happen that way at all like at all at all what i'm gonna what i'm gonna advise miss j is what i'm advising for everyone it's what i do for my for my own you know affiliate business um and it's what it's what brings in it's what brings in commissions and as i start as i study other affiliates as i study top youtubers as i study how they're doing it and they're and how they're building their income streams and and really leveraging all this out it's by it's it by it's by what i'm going to tell you it's it simply comes down to building an audience and 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 no not driving traffic to a website you're not going to take it to a website no definitely not a website you're going to be taking them to a landing page where you can capture the lead. It's all about running paid traffic to a specific niche to capture a lead. And up front, there, there. I mean, if you were, if you were, if you were really, really with it, and if you were really, really dedicated and really passionate about whatever niche you're in, if you're an affiliate marketer, you're fired up about some niche. That's why you're willing to go out there and promote products, whether you're talking about it or whether you're running traffic to it. It doesn't matter you're still willing to promote a product. I'm assuming because you're somewhat interested in that interest or somewhat interested in that demographic or, or, or you're somewhat interest in, interested in that niche or genre or whatever it may be, right? And that's why you feel you want to promote these types of products. Um, whatever it may be, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Whatever it may be. You want to find that niche. You want to find that niche, and you want to you want to start running paid traffic to a landing page to that niche, and give them up something and give up something of value for free to build a list. To build a list, so you can then run offers and email your list of a bunch of different promotions. You can you can email offers to your list because now you have a list of of let's just say three thousand people that all 
came all saw some type of ad, let's say you're in the diet niche. Again, you got to be fired up. I truly believe now, do you, is everyone fired up? Probably not. But do I believe the best of the best are? Yes. The best of the best affiliate marketers are fired up about a specific niche. They go into that niche. They find a bunch of different products inside that niche. They build a brand around that niche. They talk about that niche and they offer products and a lot, of the, a lot of the products are from other people. So therefore, they are an affiliate marketer and they're promoting them, whether they're talking about them on a YouTube channel, whether they're talking about them via email, whether they're talking about that niche via Facebook Live. That person is fired up about whatever that niche may consist of. And now we're going to offer a bunch of products through it, right, to our audience. But how do we get the audience? Again, either you're doing video. So Miss J, you're either going to be doing video to, to attract an audience, whatever niche you're fired up about, what I, what I would encourage you to do is start a YouTube channel. Start a YouTube channel in 2020. Start it now. You have to start it now. Start a YouTube channel now and start talking about that niche. Okay, so if you're trying to be an affiliate marketer, it's not just about ClickBank. It's not just about Kartra. It's not about ClickFunnels. It's not just about any of these platforms. It's about it's about knowing, okay, what am I fired up about? What is my passion in? What is my interest in? What can I get behind? What can I start talking about? And, and it all starts with that YouTube channel. You're going to start putting out video. That's what I would do. That's what I would do in 2020. From this point on, I would start putting out video on whatever you're promoting, right? And, and it's not in a sales way. It's just educating. You're talking about it. You know, what do I do on my channel? I talk about landing pages and email automation and Facebook ads and, and online entrepreneurship. Like that's what I talk about on this channel. That's stuff that I'm doing, right? Whatever you're fired about, fired up about, whatever you're doing, build a YouTube channel. Build a YouTube channel and start talking about it. That's what I would do for sure. And then the links in the description, the links in the in the description. So when you look at anyone's video, right? You go to anyone's video, look at my video. Let's go to um When you just look at anyone's video, this is where more affiliate marketing takes place. Is when you look at anyone's description, right? Anyone that's somewhat doing it, anyone that's somewhat, you know, trying to get videos out. Like this one, I, you know, this video is a, a video that I put up, you know, July 15th, 1900 views. So this one's actually going pretty well. Um, But if you look in the description, if you look in the description, there's links. There's links. This is a link for my affiliate offer, right? I'm trying to get I'm trying to get everyone and their mother on Kartra. There's a link in my description. When you scroll down even more, guess what? There's another link. When people click on this link, because I've been building an agency, that's my my my, my bread and butter. That's what brings in my daily income. Um, which is what I'm scaling now into a digital course stream of income, which is 2020. But since 2016, it's been building an agency, um, closing clients, closing clients and, 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 and building that up full time since 2016. That's a digital agency blueprint. So what am I doing? In, what am I doing with this link over here? I'm also promoting that link, right? And that's getting people onto my email list. So when I do eventually release that course, Digital Agency Blueprint is going to be teaching people exactly how I built my agency, how I took it to six figures, how I, how I then spun it into a digital course, um, what, I, what I, like every detail on how I built my agency since 2016, that's Digital Agency Blueprint. But in that link, as people go to that page, right, they come to the page, they opt in not only are they going to be on my list and, and be my best students when I do release that course, because they're going to give, they're going to get all, everything I got. Um, but also when you're on this list, here's the reality. And I'm going to keep it real with you guys. When you opt into this list, I'm going to show you, I literally have 20 plus emails that are already designed and set ready to go. They're already written. Like I spent a couple hours on a Sunday, typed out a bunch of emails put all the hyperlinks and made it look all legit. And it's basic text, basic email, everyone can do it. But my point is, is that this is my, this is affiliate marketing. 
I get people to opt in over here. And not only, so again, that link is in this, is in the description, but not only are these people, you know, fired up to learn about what I'm doing to build my agency, but those are people that I'm also emailing regarding Kartra because without Kartra, I wouldn't be able to, I wouldn't be able to build anything online, not my agency, not my, um, not my digital products, not my digital course, not my email automation, not my landing pages, not my affiliate marketing side of it all. I wouldn't be able to do any of that without Kartra. So Kartra is a huge product that I promote. That's my affiliate marketing. And I love Kartra because it's that tool that I believe every online entrepreneur needs. And it's also that software that will pay me residually. It pays me monthly, right? I get you onto the account. You're paying $99 every month. You need it for your entire business. You're fired up on it. You're going to keep it regardless of who the heck I am. You don't even know me. You don't even care. It's something you need for your business and you stay on it. And that $99 a month, we make 40%, which is a decent little commission. But if I can get a few of those monthly and get it residually, it doesn't take that many per month to really change someone's life. You put 50 people on the system, you're making 40 bucks per. That's not a bad monthly income residually. You know, you put 100 people on there. You know what I mean? That's not a bad income at all, like residually. So as people get onto this list, I have emails that are set up that go out automatically getting people familiar with Kartra and, and, and really putting it in, in putting the emails in ways where um, it relates to what we're talking about. Like they opted in because they, they want to build an agency as well. They're curious on how I did it. Here's how I did it. Here's the tool that I use. In fact, I use it for my calendars. So when I go to schedule appointments with my clients, I send them to my Kartra calendar, click on this link and take a look at the calendar side of Kartra. Dude, when they click on that link in email number nine, it takes them to my affiliate link on the Kartra calendar and educates them. And then they end up doing the 14 day trial. When it comes to leads, I'll send them another email that's already set up, ready to go out. And this email is talking about the lead component within Kartra and how I'm able to manage all my social media clients and all my leads that come in because of this component within Kartra. Click here. They click there. It's my affiliate link. Or another email that I got going, going out automatically is an email talking about landing pages. And I'm telling them, hey, man, this is what I do with my clients. All via email, right? Basic couple sentences. Take a look at it. It's how I built all my landing pages. Click here. They click on it. They go to, they go to Kartra. They take a look at it, man, and that's my affiliate link. That's affiliate marketing. So it doesn't matter your niche. I'm telling you, you should be fired up about it because that's going to allow you to come over here to ClickBank, right? If you're not familiar with ClickBank, go to clickbank.com and just set up your free account. You can just come over here, clickbank.com, set up your free account. And then once you set up your free account, you'll be in the actual, um, um, marketplace. So when you come in here, log in here, you're going to click on marketplace up here at the top. Okay. Click on marketplace. And then over here to the left in red, there's all these different categories, all these different categories. What are you fired up about? This is about making money online, man. That's what this whole video is about. Affiliate marketing in 2020. A lot of you bozos out there are, do, are still doing it wrong. You're still doing it wrong. It's time to wake up and, and, and get fired up about something. What can we really get fired up about, which will allow us to want to promote it or even talk about it? And whether that's in writing, whether that's in written form or it's in video, I'm telling you to go out there and, on video and start making a YouTube channel. That's where I'm telling you to start. Um, and, then, and then these links in the description will allow you to build your list, will allow people to, to, to opt in and, because you're giving away something for free. You're giving away something of value or you're sending them to maybe something like this. But here's what a lot of people do. A lot of beginner or a lot of amateur, you know, freaking um, affiliates, they'll come in here. They'll, let's say they're fired up about health and fitness. They'll come in here, they'll look at all the different offers, how much they can make per, per sale. They'll get the link, they click on promote. And then we're gonna generate hop links. And then there goes my link. What a lot of amateurs still do is they'll take that link and they'll go post it on Facebook right now. Or they'll take that link and they'll go post it in a Facebook group. Or they'll take that link and post it on LinkedIn. Or they'll take that link and tweet it. 
that's really all you can do. You can't take that link and put it on Instagram. You can't do that. You can't do it on TikTok. You can't do it on, on Snapchat. You're going to take that link and post it on LinkedIn, um, Twitter, Facebook, or shit. That's it. And, and what I'm telling you right now is that 99.99999% of the time, that ain't going to do nothing for you. It ain't going to do nothing for you. And that's what everyone's doing. Um, they're just taking that link and posting it when it's like, dude, you cannot do that. And here's what a lot of amateurs do as well. A lot of amateurs will take that link and go run a Facebook ad. And they'll run a Facebook ad directly to that link, right? Because here's my link. This is my link. Look, this um, this um, person here, whoever freaking Leb Lebitox, Lebitox, whoever the heck Lebitox is, right? Here's the affiliate page so I can come here and I can go read all about that product before I decide to promote it for sure, right? But let's say I'm in the health and fitness and let's say this product does, you know, suit my my interest and and I feel that it'll it, it fits my, you know, my audience and my, my, um, yeah, my audience. And let's say I'm in that industry and I want to run an ad. What a lot of people do, look, I got my link, right? I copied my link. This is the link that the company gave me. It has my affiliate username right there, Inspired TV, right there, right? That's how I know it's my link. So this is the page that I would drive traffic to. Okay. This is a video. This is, this is, this is the video. Look, Nothing else to it. Simple landing page. This is what this affiliate, or not affiliate, I'm the affiliate, right? The person of this page, this is their offer. This is their digital product. It's not a physical product. It's a digital product. So that's what I'm saying. When you're on ClickBank, majority of these products are digital products. You'll find some that are physical products, like on Amazon, for sure, physical products. But on, on ClickBank, which ClickBank happens to be the most popular affiliate marketplace. That's where a lot of people go online to, to grab links, to find out, to go to the marketplace and then to find out what they're interested in, right? What's their interest? They find their niche over here to the left. Okay. Are you fired up about, you know, education? Are you fired up about e-business and e-marketing? Are you fired up about cook, cooking food and wine, you know, business investing? Like what are you fired up about health and fitness? Right. And so what I'm saying is that you cannot grab this link, right? You're going to look at all these different commissions that you can make. You don't want to grab that link and run a Facebook ad straight to that link. Okay. Here's, here's my page. This is what, what the company gave me, right? This is what the owner, whoever the hell has this offer. This is what they gave me. This is my link. I don't want to run a Facebook ad straight to that link. Okay. Because I'm paying for that ad. And at the, and, 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 and at the end of it all, I want to make sure that I capture a lead from it. If I'm going to pay for an ad, it's not going to go straight to an offer without me getting someone's name and email. You have to get their name and email first. Okay. You get their name and email first. You send them to one single page. You send them to one single page where they opt in for something. Let's say, let's say, find out, let's say this, look, look, this offer, do this five second water hack to lose one pound of fat every 72 hours. This right here is not even something you can really even advertise on Facebook, first of all, because it's more of a it's more of a, a crazy, you know, freaking um statement than 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 anything else. So most likely you can't offer straight out, you can't run this as a straight ad with this being the headline, for example. That's why what I'm saying is that a lot of these offers, you you won't even be able to run ads straight to it because Facebook has their policy and they hate that. They don't want you running ads straight to an offer like this. But if you were running an ad, let's say you, this, let's say this was our industry, right? We clicked on um, cooking food and wine, but but let's let's go back to let's go back to that health one. Let's say we clicked on on the health one, which was which was this one. Okay, rather than taking them here to this offer right away you're going to take them to some type of download. You're going to take them what I would do. What I would do is I would take them to some type of free PDF. Click here to get the five, to learn the five tips on how to increase, on how to decrease belly fat in 2020. And it's some type of free training video or free guide. But in order for them to get here, they had to, they had to put their name and email in first, right? They had to put their name and email in first. Don't take them straight here because a lot of times you'll have your drop off rate and you didn't even capture that lead. 
you want that lead. You want that lead. That's why I take people here. There's no video. There's no fancy fluff. It's straight. Come over here. Learn how I built a highly profitable six-figure social media agency offered, offering five simple services to easy clients. And then this, it's this one button, teach me, right? Teach me. It's taking them straight to one single opt-in. And then you can take them to your offer like this, right? And then this could be the thank you page. You take them here, then, th then you take them here. But at the same time, you're going to have that dropout rate. Not everyone's going to buy this offer. This is a straight up offer. Not everyone's going to buy this exact offer right away. But the benefit that you have is that you have the email. You have the contact information. You built an email list. Like I'm telling you, people come to this page. They opt in. And now they're on my email list. So even if they don't get Kartra right away, I'm still going to email them 27 more times. In fact, let me show you the list. Let, let me show you the sequence. When they opt in there, you come over here, my communications on the left. If you guys haven't tried out Kartra, man, there's a 14 day trial profit with Kartra.online. That link is in the description. That, that brings you, that brings me to my other link. Let's go down even further real quick. I'll just go back up. That's this one profit with Kartra.online. So look, Miss J, this is what I'm doing. Building a YouTube channel. I got my links in the description. These are taking people to affiliate offers for sure. This is taking someone to a digital course, right? FB ads for beginners. I'm going to be putting out a super basic, inexpensive course in 2020, teaching people the most important basics on Facebook advertising. I've been running Facebook advertising for a long time. I've been doing it for clients and now myself. And so I want to teach you the basics. Like I'm not promising you the world. I want to teach you the most important basics because I've taken so many courses. It's how I learned Facebook ads. It's how I learned Instagram ads. It's how I learned YouTube ads. Taking courses, you want to invest in yourself, man. You're either going to invest money into, in, into education or you're going to invest your time and watch every YouTube video under the sun. Either one, you're spending something. Spend your time or spend your money. I'm going to have a very inexpensive Facebook course teaching people the, the very most important basics and that's fb ads for beginners so that that's my digital course right or one of my digital courses but those are all and look fiverr for those of you that are looking to create ebooks or create some kind of download right that you can give your offer you can give if you're if your industry is diet or food and wine can we offer something for free download your top 10 recipes for 2020 and you're driving and you're running ads to people who love that, who have that interest of food, wine, health, and fitness. You're running ads on Facebook directly to that interest, right? And you're offering them some type of free 10 recipe guide on how to make the best freaking cupcakes and wine in 2020. And you're giving away some type of offer and you're giving it out to people who you know that are interested in a certain thing. That's what it's all about, man. That's what it's all about. So that's what I'm saying. YouTube channel, you're going to build a YouTube channel. You're going to talk about this one thing or you're going to run Facebook ads. And, 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 and I would, what I would do is I would give away, I would give away something for free. I would give away some PDF or some download. If you're in health and fitness, okay, can you give away some five page download on how to lose weight? If you're in the food industry, can you give away a five page PDF, a, a five page free download on, um, the top five recipes. If you're in, you know, yoga, can you give away a five page or if you own a yoga studio, can you give away a, a free uh, seven day pass, right? Like there's so many, think of what you guys do, man. You guys can give away something. You, you guys can. That's how I would build the list. I would give away something for free through a, through a paid ad, through a Facebook ad, an Instagram ad, or a YouTube ad. You give away something for free in order to build that list or you're building a YouTube and or I should say and or you're building a YouTube channel talking about that niche talking about that interest and in your links in your description you have links but at the end of the day look dude I'm taking people to these links for one thing and one thing only and that's to build an email list that's to build an email list because it's through my email list that's what I was going to show you look I hit my, communi my communications, I hover over, I hit sequences. Let me show you the sequence for one of my affiliate 
offers. Um, it is digital agency blueprint. 88 people are on this sequence. Okay. Now these are people that went to, now I keep it clean. There was probably a couple hundred, but I'm always taking out leads or actually probably not that many, probably a little over a hundred. I'm always taking out leads or, or, or clearing the ones that are blocked or clearing the ones that bounce. You know, sometimes people opt in and they'll put the wrong email. So you want to look at your list all the time to clean out your list, right? To keep your list legit and, and strong. Um, and so look, dude, 88 people on this sequence, when they opt in because they're interested in building an agency, right? They opt in and that's the information I'm going to give them. And what I do is I sprinkle offers in there. So you're not going to offer, offer, offer. You're not going to get your Amazon link or your ClickBank link and freaking send, an, send them an email every day. No, on an offer. No, you're not going to do that. You're not going to sell them a new freaking ClickBank product every day. You're not going to do that. All right. You have to sprinkle it in. You have to bring value. Like if you're after fitness or if you're after yoga or if you're teaching people how to sing or you're teaching them how to play an instrument, whatever it is, man, it doesn't matter. You're an affiliate marketer in that niche grabbing products on ClickBank. You can grab products on ClickBank. You can grab products on Amazon. Amazon, you can become an associate on Amazon and get every product under the sun on Amazon and, and make a commission every time someone buys it. You can even come in here to, to, um, to Kartra. You can come in here to Kartra. I'll show you after this part. But you can grab so many different digital products from other people and you can be an affiliate and you can offer their product to your audience and make a commission. But I'm telling you, man, this is how you want to do it. This is how you want to do it. You don't want to just grab that link and post it on your website. Like you're not going to do it that way. You want to, you want to drive that. You want to drive, you want to drive it to a landing page, capture the lead and then build the email list. That's, that's the bottom line in this email list, in this sequence, I should say you opt in and this is how many emails I have set up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 15 emails. So I have 15 emails all designed, set out to go every three days. Look, this is how I set it up. It goes every three days, every three days, and then it goes four days, and then it goes every five days, and then it goes every seven days. You see that? So I have 15 emails that are set up to go out throughout those days. Like that's a lot of emails, man. And, and I want to add 10 more to tell you the truth. Put, put it at 25 and just have 25 emails that are already designed, ready to go out. So when you opt in, you're getting offers, man. Like I'm not sending an offer on every single one of them, but a lot of them I am. A lot of them I am. And they're just, it's just teaching people what I'm doing. What am I doing? I'm freaking using Kartra for all of this shit. And I'm talking about it. And I'm talking about it in my emails. And if you click, it happens to go to my affiliate offer where I happen to make a commission. That right there is what you want to do, man. That's how you want to do it. You want to build that YouTube channel. You want to build that list. And again, in order for you to take them to the, to the, to, in order for you to get them on a list, you need a landing page. And that's why what she was asking over here, let's go back to the, um, to the, um, to the, to the comments. She was asking, should I take it to a website or a landing page? I think I kind of answered that one, right? You want to, you want to take it to a landing page and you want to build that email list so you can email them offers, ClickBank offers, Kartra offers, you know, Amazon associate offers, whatever offers you got, build the audience, man, build the audience first and then, and then just start in, and, and then start, start emailing them. And, and again, talking about it on YouTube, that's what you, you want to do for sure. So I'm pretty sure I ran, I, 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 I ran that one down and answered that question. And then I put yes. And then she put, thank you so much for your reply, but someone is building my landing page already. Okay. Um, okay. And I will, and I will need help building a list. I can't thank you enough for your reply. I finally feel someone in the world has seen me hear and care for me. Okay, perfect. So I think you'll need your time every now. I'll sign up for Kartra. So boom. So she now, so now look, now she's going to sign up for Kartra, right? So 
that's what I would do, Miss J. Is is I would I would run it that way. You got it. You got it. You're either gonna get great at Facebook ads, Instagram ads, YouTube ads. You're gonna get really good at paid traffic. That's number one. You're either gonna get get really good at paid traffic, or you're gonna build a YouTube channel. Really, to tell you the truth, I mean, that that's how I would do it. What are you gonna do? Start a blog, and start writing about it on your blog. Okay, how are you gonna get traffic to your blog? Right. Like there. So it's like at the end of the day, man, pay, pay traffic, pay traffic, pay traffic. And I would say also not not or it's and pay traffic and build a YouTube channel. Bottom line. That's what I would do for sure. And then all the links go straight to a landing page where you're capturing the lead and building an email list and sending that email list offers after offers after offers after offers, but keeping it authentic, keeping it genuine and keeping it fired up. And, and that's why you want to go after an interest that you're fired up on, man. Go after your passion. Go, go, go after these different interests. Like let's say you're a full-time accountant and you hate what you do, but you love your Saturdays because Saturday morning you take yoga and you guys are at the beach and you guys do a yoga class for two hours and you do it every Saturday morning from 7 a.m. to 9 a.m. And, and you just can't wait for it. And, 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 and after a long week of work, you're nine to five at your corporate job that you can't stand. You can't wait for that Saturday. Dude, you're fired up about yoga. Go become an affiliate in the yoga space. Start a YouTube channel. Start talking about it. Start filming these yoga classes that you're going to. Put it up on YouTube. Start a Facebook page. Start getting your social media going. And at the end of it all, start running paid ads. You start doing yoga for two years. All of a sudden, you got crazy positions. You put together a simple guide or a simple training video course on it. People will flock to you, man. That's what you want to do. That's what you want to do. You were never... You never were a professional yoga instructor before. You happen to be just fired up about it, and you like, and 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 and, and you decided to build a like-minded community around it as well, and 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 this whole affiliate marketing thing is just based on finding products that you can get fired up on and offer to other people. But online, you got to be strategic about it. Online, it's going to happen through building a brand. It's going to happen through building a brand. And I truly believe there's no better way to do it than on YouTube because you're, 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 you're physically, visually talking about it. And that, that's what allows you to build an audience to begin with is the fact that it's you. It's video. That's why you guys are here on my YouTube channel now. But um, it's either going to be that or it's going to be paid traffic, man. Paid traffic and, and, running, and, and running traffic to an offer, giving them some type of a value for free in the form of some type of PDF or some type of training video, a digital product, right? Um, to build that list, you're going to build that list. And, and again, man, the, the, the money is in that list. Okay. You got to get really good at, at list. And that's why I use Kartra. I use Kartra for everything for the landing page hosting and for the email autoresponder and also the affiliate marketing. So when I cut, so this whole email autoresponder, I, if it wasn't Kartra, I'd have to go get MailChimp. I'd have to go get, you know, freaking um, Sendlane. I'd have to go get some type of, of email autoresponder. And that's a whole nother monthly service. So it's like, dude, you got your website and then you got to go get your email autoresponder. And then you got to go get a landing page software. Dude, cancel the website, Miss J. You don't need a website. Um, you, need, you need landing pages. You need to build an email list. That's just my personal opinion. You can have a website and have like a one page website with a bunch of offers on it, but you're, but you're going you're gonna to make sure you're Facebook pixeling everyone who visits it because you're obviously going to be eventually running ads to those people. So at the end of the day, it's, it's, it's paid traffic to a landing page. So sequences for sure. And then what I was going to show you in here is, um, is your is affiliate marketing. So in here, just like ClickBank, you got your different offers over here in the marketplace, right? You click on marketplace, you got all these different offers you can go through and, and get your personal link for all of them, um, right? You can do that here. You can do that on Amazon and get every freaking product on Amazon. Look, I go to Amazon. Let's, let's go to Amazon because I have Amazon set up as well. Um, So I come in here, right? If 
Okay, look, so I, I come in. I come over here, I hit, I hit product links. I hit product links here at the top and I can literally come over here and I can grab any freaking link I want. I can type in headphones. I type in headphones and boom, I get my link. Here's my link right here. So I got these link, these right here. I click on the drop down. I click on shorten URL. There is my link. Now I cut a video before and that video still to this day has been my highest viewed video. There's like almost 50,000 views, which isn't even a lot, but it is a lot shit. And that video to this day, because I'm monetized now, that video pays me every month, man. It's absolutely mind blowing. Um, royalties, man. But in that video, I was talking about how you can come over here, grab this link, and then go post it on Facebook. That's what I, I did that video on, right? That's how a lot of people still try to do it. I just got done speaking the last 20 minutes on why you don't want to do it that way. You have to, you have to, you have to build a list, man. You have to build a list or you have to build a YouTube channel. You have to. Um, um, because this link, this is a link that you could put in the description of your YouTube videos, it can go in the description, or it's a link that you'll be emailing your list. People who are interested in instruments or music or hardware or software, people that are into that type of, 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 of products, those are people who would be on that list. So if you all of a sudden did a video, or if you all of a sudden you know did a review, or something talk, or you had a, you had something to do with this product, and you wanted to, to to send it out on your on your email list, that's how you can do it, man. Again, that could have been a product that I grabbed from Amazon. It could have been a product I grabbed from freaking ClickBank. It could have been a product that I came over here to the marketplace. I click on my affiliate promos in Kartra. I click on marketplace. And now I can come in here and I can look at all these different products from other people, all markets. I can go to health and beauty. I can go to internet marketing. It's the same thing for all these platforms, man. All these people have digital products or they have some type of course or they have some type of, of, of digital download and I can grab my link and go promote it. But I'm telling you, you can't just do it on social media. You want to you wanna either run paid traffic to a landing page to capture the lead and build an email list. So then you can now take that same individual and offer them multiple products down the line. You're going to do that. And you're going to also build a YouTube channel. You're going to build a YouTube channel, bottom line. Now, do you absolutely have to be... Um, a YouTuber to build an affiliate marketing business? Not necessarily. You don't necessarily have to do it that way, but I'm telling you right now, you should. That'd be the best. That'd be the best. Building a YouTube channel, talking about whatever the heck you're fired up about, um, links in the description, and also running paid ads to people to find your interest to find the people who are interested in that as well. And now you have a bunch of different products that you can eventually email them and and build build a relationship via email and get them to buy a bunch of stuff that way as well so that's how i would do it man i use kartra for everything for my affiliate marketing if i want to come in here and grab someone's offer and send it to my email list i could totally do that i could totally do that and so that's an option man that's that's the opportunity we have all these different platforms it's all about grabbing your link at the end of the day you need to have an audience you need to have a list to be able to offer that link to okay and it's not going to happen by just posting it on social media. It's not going to happen that way. Build yourself a list. Um, Kartra allows me to build all my pages. It allows me to build my email autoresponder, my calendar hosting, so much in Kartra, man. But just on this affiliate marketing side alone, I can come in here and, and find different affiliate products. I need it for my email autoresponder, and I need it for my pages. That's why Kartra is worth every penny for me. And being an affiliate marketer, that's the icing on the cake. Because I'm an affiliate marketer, I go out there and promote the product as well. That's all I'm doing on this channel. I'm talking about landing pages, email automation, making sales online. I'm talking about all that that I'm talking about. And I'm an actual, I'm an, I'm an actual affiliate around behind as well, right? And I'm taking that content and I'm putting on YouTube where the links and dude i'm telling i'm preaching what i'm telling you man i'm, I'm preaching to the uh, well, how, what's the word where, what am i looking for it's it's i'm freaking um i'm a product of the product i'm a product of the freaking product i'm a product of the product what i'm telling you i freaking am doing here with you now 
I'm going to just end it there, man. That's a mic drop. I just, it, it blows my mind. What exactly what I'm telling you is exactly what I'm doing. So it's how I've been able to build my affiliate business side of it all, you guys. And I do all that through Kartra. And, um, and so Kartra just, it, it allows so much, man. It's not even funny. It's not even funny. So step your game up in 2020, build that list, get good at paid traffic and build a channel. I'm telling you, man, you'll make more commissions than you could possibly handle. I'll see you in the next video.